What just happened? What just happened? What a throw! <laughs> Oh, man, I'm so ready for today. What's going on, guys? And welcome back to Modern Warfare 3. And as y'all can see, man, we are on zombies today because we gotta unlock something. That's right, man. As you guys can see, we are currently three weapons away from unlocking the Borealis camo. Before we get into it, man, I want you guys to go down below, drop a like on the video, and let me know in the comments what is better, Interstellar or Borealis. So the last weapons we need to get done real quick is the MCW. We also have the WSP Stinger and the RGL launcher. Quickly, man, before we get into it, I want to give a shout out to these people on the screen right now. If you guys want to shout out my next video, go down below, comment Noti Gang. But all right, man, we're going to load up to our final game of zombies and unlock this camo. Alrighty, fellas, we are here in Zombies, and we are about to unlock Borealis. Also, I want to give a huge shout-out to my man, Jorvi. He has been helping me on this Zombies camo grind. That's what we need, and let's go, baby. Pack a bunch, too. Jorvi has been helping me out with the strategy on how to kill these special or elite zombies. He's also been helping me get, like, all the schematics, all, like, the refined ether crystals to pack a punch and do everything. I will admit, man, I love this mode. I love Zombies, and I've kind of been having, sometimes, more fun than multiplayer. Honestly, just so fun just to kind of like relax and play with friends. But yeah, my goal was actually to unlock Interstellar and Borealis before season one drops in literally just a few days. Of course, man, let me know how your guys' camo journey is going on MW3. Do you guys have Interstellar? Do you guys have Borealis? Maybe some of you guys have both. Basically, there's a little bit of a strategy here where if you go to these Outlast contracts in the tier two zone, they constantly spawn the special or elite zombies that you need. Right now, we're in the tier three zone. We're going to deliver this cargo truck for 5,000 essence. Once we do that, we're going to go to a pack-a-punch machine, just pack-a-punch our second weapon. And don't get me wrong, man, I am really excited to see all the multiplayer content for Season 1, but Season 1 for zombies is also looking really, really good. And I find it so funny, man, because a lot of people have been talking about round-based zombies, how a lot of people in the community want the traditional round-based zombies mode to come back. And I'm sure we're going to be getting new round-based zombies modes next year with Treyarch's next Call of Duty game. But low-key, I think it's more fun than the round-based zombies. I don't know if that's a hot take. It probably is. I might get some hate for saying that but like sometimes i get bored with the round base zombies all right so we're gonna get out of here we're gonna pack a punch our second weapon boom and there we go the pack a punch grenade launcher now we're gonna go in here we're gonna activate this freaking thing i don't know it activate the pnd boom we're gonna activate it and now we're gonna stand in this purple room and get the percentage to 26 there's gonna be a ton of zombies spawning um a lot of hellhounds that are really really annoying and that's gonna make it spawn special or elite zombies oh here we go here we go here we go we got the mangler we got the mangler we got two we got two okay we got to be careful here y'all can follow me that's just fine there's one and that should be two perfect the hellhounds are so annoying because they cause this fire damage on the ground and it can sometimes kill the special or elite zombie that you need take it down take it down there we go perfect come on 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 yes got it we're gonna kill him because we're not gonna take that much damage yep got that perfect Got him. Perfect. But the Disciple is so annoying because it can regen health like this. Okay. Okay. I killed one. I think there's another. Come on. 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 There we go. Wow. Mangler's weak. Got it. Hey, there we go. Serpent today. Okay. So now we're on this. Please die. Thank you. Okay. So now we have the RGL. This thing is going to be a little bit annoying and tedious. Oh, we got blessed and we got insta kill. That's going to be so perfect for these zombies. Come on. There we go. Got it. Got it. Oh my gosh. I'm getting so lucky. That insta kill was beautiful. Got it. Nice. We got the disciple who's going to be weak now because of the nuke. Got it. Let's go. Come on. Come on. Come on. Thank you. That should be it. Come on. Yes. Special zombie. There we go. Perfect. Come on. Come on. There we go. Oh, we're done. We're done. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Come on. All right. So, Jory, drop me my last weapon. Come on. There we go. So, we actually have the fire damage on this, and the manglers go so down very quickly. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. There we go. Oh, my God. We're killing it right now. Come on. Come on. There we go, bro. Come on. There we go. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Yes, dude. It's about to pop up. Like, we're about to see Borealis, bro. Come on, come on, let's go. Is that it? I don't think that's it. Oh, let's go, Borealis. Oh, GG. 
GG, fellas. We got the camo. But it's kind of funny because um the grind isn't really over. Yes, we have Interstellar. Now we have Borealis, but there is one mastery camo we're missing. That is for the MW2 camos in Zombie. Yes, you can use the MW2 weapons, go into Zombies, and there's a whole nother camo to unlock called Bioluminescent. I think you need to do like 51 or 52 weapons from the MW2 game to get this camo. 3,000 likes on this video. I'll go for the camo. I'll put myself through it again. All right, man, the heli is here. We're gonna hop in. Get us out of this. All right, come on, show it to me. There we go. All right, so we head over to Zombies Mastery. We got the Golden Enigma, Zircon Scale, Serpent Tonight, and Borealis. It's finally done, bro. It is done. Tomorrow. Oh, this looks so good. I'll be honest, I was using Interstellar on like every single weapon, so it feels nice to finally have a different camo. And some of my favorite colors are just blue and purple, and this is like the exact camo that I personally wanted. I'm so glad I got it right before season one as well. There's a guy literally right here. Are we good? Are we chilling? I don't know. We're playing Rust, so I'm a little... I'm a little bit scared. We got a UAV. Yeah, season one is starting very, very soon. I'm really excited for the swarm and the EMP, the brand new kill streaks. I just think, what the? F oh, they ate my bomb. Are you? I ate the bomb, bro. I ate the bomb. We got a counter UAV. We gotta look this way though. Have to. Thank you. Oh my gosh. No, no, no. I'm actually scared, bro. Wait. I'm actually scared, bro. I don't know what to do. There's so many people pushing this A flag. We gotta get out. There's someone also right in front of me. I don't like this, bro. No, you okay, there we go. Come on. Are we good? All right, I'm gonna slide out of here. Holy crap. But yeah, of course, guys, let me know in the comments. Do you guys have Borealis? Do you like Interstellar or Borealis more? I just like the colors, I think, on Borealis a little bit more. I'm not gonna lie. But I also don't think Interstellar is a bad camo. A lot of people have been saying Interstellar is like the exact same thing as Orion, but I just don't see it at all. I think I'm just gonna climb up now, now that we have the, uh, the Avantra V. We can hopefully... Make a little bit of a play. There's a guy just chilling right here. Oh my gosh. No, that's actually so annoying. Wait. Are they trying to shoot down my shrieks? We good? What just happened? What just ha What a throw! Well, I'm gonna now camp up top because I deserve it. I, I got absolutely destroyed. Please don't kill me. Please don't kill me. Please don't kill me. Thank you. Thank you. Yup. Thank you. Put up this counter because they just got a UAV, which is crazy. Oh my God. I'm gonna, bro, I'm gonna need to get down. I'm gonna need to get down very, very soon, bro. Oh my God. They want to kill me so bad. Oh, I'm gonna need to jump down very soon. Oh, he's climbing up. Oh my God. Two people are climbing. I got it. Oh my God. I got the event. I got the event. Oh my God. No, bro. I can't see. I can't see. Bro, I need to get down. All right, I'm jumping down. I needed to jump down, bro. Oh my gosh. No, are we good? Are we good? Oh my God, I'm on a 17. Bro, we are getting absolutely destroyed. Oh my gosh. Wait, wait. I'm dead, bro. I'm dead. Are we good? Bro. Oh my gosh. Wait, there's a guy here. He's dead. Oh my gosh, there's multiple people. This guy's climbing up. I gotta, I gotta get away. This guy right here. Can you please push up? This guy's literally just camping. I think there's a guy up top now. I think there's an enemy up top. I'm not even joking. I'm not even joking. This guy's climbing up. What do you think you're doing? I can't even focus right now. Oh my gosh. I need to drop this Borealis nuke, bro. I need to drop this Borealis nuke. This will be my first one. This will be my first one. There's a guy down there. Wait, they just spawned on me. I need to, I need to run. There's a guy just chilling in there. Got him. Got him. I'm on a 25. Wait, I have no ammo though. Oh, this is bad. I have no ammo. Literally, I have no ammo. I don't know what to do. I think I literally chill here and hope to God I can get a knife kill or something. I also have the Borealis Karambit as well. I need to make this count. I need to make this count. This guy spawned right here. We're on a 27. Are we good? Oh my gosh, please. Please. Guys, I know I've just been camping, but I literally, I could not care less. They gotta be right here. <gasps> yes, bro, we dropped it. Let's go. <laughs> Let's go. Bro, look at our dominance.
domination score. Did I have a team? Where was my team? Do we not care about the domination? Hello? Oh, let's go, baby. Our first Borealis new. Come on, come on. There we go. Oh my God, bro. I'm literally about to die. I, I should probably just call this in, right? I should... They have a sentry gun? Ah, go, 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 dial it, dial it. And ladies and gentlemen, that is the Borealis camo. Look at that, baby. <laughs> Bro, that's right away. Oh, wait, did he just say my name? Wow. What? GG's, fellas. Just because he Bro. got that. That's the real Yeah, we won the, we won the game now because of that. Bro, what was that? I got a nuke. 30 kills, 30 kills. Oh, no. <laughs> I said, man, even though we have the interstellar camo and now we have Borealis, uh, the grind isn't over. We still have all of the MW2 weapons as well. And of course, we already unlocked Orion last year, but we have a whole new set of zombies camos to unlock, including Bioluminescent. Like I said, man, 3,000 likes on this video. I will put myself through this grind. And as you can see, for Bioluminescent, you need 51 guns to complete. I feel like Golden Ivory isn't really that great. Spinal Husk actually has a pretty cool design. Arachnida, actually kind of an underrated weapon. It's a little bit animated. And then Bioluminescent isn't too bad. I just wish it kind of moved a little bit more. Like, it's barely moving. It's like a snail. But yeah, man, like I said, 3,000 likes. I will 100% do it. But thank you all so much for watching. I'll catch you guys next time.